Let's look at a huge hole, mostly 2019 AKs, some 2018 50th anniversary cars. First up, we got a 2015 Land Rover Defender double cab, Baja Blazers, and this uh, camouflage. Looks really good in this camo. I'm going to try and go through these quick. I got quite a few here. Bone Shaker. Which I'm pretty sure I got one of these uh, loose already. Don't think I have one carded. If I do, it will become a custom. Ford uh, Escort. I actually like the Super Treasure Hunt of this. I've always been a big fan of the Ford Escort. Like a old American rally car. Got one of these vans in chrome. And if they don't have the 50th logo on them, it's because they're uh, AK's 2019. So, it's Mamo Racing, Volkswagen Golf, GTI. Looks really awesome in this Mamo Racing. Can't wait to get a Mamo hauler. I don't have one of the new car culture haulers yet. That thing sits pretty low, too. Look at that. Pretty nice. A Volkswagen Beetle, a tuned. This is a 50th, but it is from the A case. Now, I don't have one of these loose. I do collect this casting loose. So, crack it open. Feels good. Crack some cars open. It's been a few videos since I've cracked any. 2017 Jeep Wrangler in blue. Looks pretty good in the blue. Now the 1970 Chevelle, my favorite Hot Wheels casting. It was not released in 2018. Kind of bummed about that. But hopefully we see it in 2019. Hopefully we see it in the car culture again. Got a custom 53 Chevy in green. Looks pretty good in the green. Looks good in the burgundy and the other colors that came in last year. Get the clear hood on this. A lot of people, they crack this hood open. Pretty sure they do put an engine in there. Because you can see through the hood. Now this card's trashed. This is only Honda Civic I found. And, uh... We're going to go ahead and crack this one open because it's on a bad card and it is not the Super. Now last year on the Supers, uh, it still looks really awesome. Really nice rear detail. And side detail, no front end detail. Still happy added to the Honda's collection. But uh the past two years, if it was a super or a treasure hunt, they didn't have no numbers up here. So you could kind of push the peg over with your hand and peek down at all the numbers. And if it didn't have a number, it was either a daredevil, because they didn't have numbers. And uh, like if it was a Kmart color exclusive, it wouldn't have a number. But either with the supers or the treasure hunts. 2019... The Civics uh, Supers I have seen all have a number up there, so they're not doing that anymore. This is a Coila DeVille uh, car. Look good in my with my retro entertainment, my screen time, and Hollywood cars. It's the only reason I got it was to throw it in the collection with them. And it's a really cool looking old car casting, so... Not quite sure what kind of car that would be. I already have one of these cracked, but I couldn't resist. I probably could have picked up 10 of these cool combis if I wanted. But I think I only got 
three. I think I only got three of them. Picked them up to do customs. Lamborghini, Roadster, Revenaton, whatever. I know I'm murdering these names. Still looks really good in the green. Happy to add it to the uh, Lamborghini collection, which is getting quite large, my loose Lamborghini collection. 2018 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon. I like this casting. I don't know what all the hype is about it. It's cool and all. I like how they put the fender flares on it. That's P case. I already have one of them open, I'm pretty sure. Nissan Skyline GTR R32. One of my favorite Hot Wheel castings. It looks awesome in this blue. Yokohama tires on it. Full rear detail. It says Skyline across the back. Love that casting. Very happy to add that to the collection. Of course, I had to pick up another one. I should have opened that one. The card's bent. Tch. Figures. Oh, well. That go in a custom pile. Got another one in red. Shout out to Fireman Food. He sent me one of these already, so I'm going to keep this one in its carded protector right now. I don't need more than one cracked open. For 2019, a 57 Chevy in blue. I love this casting. This is a classic casting I grew up with and a lot of, a lot of people out there have grown up with. Always oh, happy to have one of them to the collection. Looks good in the blue with flames too. And we got a screen time. I uh, you know what I'm gonna go ahead and crack this. I wasn't gonna, but what the heck? Uh, this has a double blister. That's plastic on the back side of it. Real pain to get out get it out oh that's actually a little stand i thought that was for your finger so it's a little stand the back that's rubber think of that rubber don't want no kid i guess they can chew on it but yeah that back piece is rubber this is metal a little bit it's like a really thin metal plate look how thin that is Probably should have been a little thicker than that, I would think. Pretty cool, though. It'll look nice with all my screen time vehicles. Try and put it on its little stand here. There we go. Put it up on top of the golf. Kind of looks like they're... Got a visitor from another planet. Actually, that was a, us all on it. No, I don't know. I'm not a huge Star Wars fan. Don't hold me to it. Next is a 71 Mustang Mach 1. I think they've released this in red before, but I don't think they've ever released it with these rims. I love this casting, though. It's one of my favorite Hot Wheels castings. Is a Mach 1. It's one of my favorite castings and die cast period out of any casting i mean it don't matter if it's a johnny lightning or the hot wheels i like to see green light do a mock one next is a 71 al camino and this satin green or something i don't know looks pretty sweet with the flames i really like this one this variation that has an empty open bed happy to add that to the collection running out of room here too many cars too many cars say that every time i look at my garage 2017 ford f-150 raptor 
and this black with orange eco boost delivery on the side graphics all over this orange base the fender flares are part of the interior and the bed so all that's gray even though it has an orange base it's pretty cool really like the raptor casting they did a heck of a job with it and i know i got some more i think i already had both of these open so i bought them keep carded the barbie did not have one of these loose so let me crack this one open I look good at my Hollywood collection. Barbie car. My girls freaked out when they seen this. They love it. If I can pick up three more, four more of them, I'm going to have to get four more of them. I got three girls and the wife, so I'll need four more of them for, for them. They ain't getting mine. Another bone shaker. Another one of these. I'm going to throw a set of real riders on this. I really like this casting. It's pretty pretty badass in the Moon Eyes delivery. I didn't pick up the flat gray. I seen the flat gray. I'm like, oh, I already have that. I didn't realize it came out in three color variations this year. So now I'm going to have to get it. Another one of these might become a Bree Racing hauler. I don't know. I'm going to do something cool with this one. I already have one of these, so... Happy pick up another one. And we got a 2015 Cadillac Escalade by Matchbox. This casting's awesome. If you guys see this out there, go ahead and pick it up because it uh, seems like all these are worth 10 and 20 bucks a couple years down the road. They're hard to go back and to get, but right now you can find them in the store for a dollar. Can't beat it. Pretty good front detail. Nice rear detail. Them brake lights go all the way up the side. Really happy to add that to the loose collection. Really happy to find that on the pegs, actually. Got one of these. I don't know if I have one of these open or not. I don't know. I think I might, so I'm not going to crack it right now. One of these. I'm pretty sure I don't have one of these open, so I'm going to crack this one open. If I do, I might customize this one. Paint up the dogs and stuff. Who knows? Looks really cool. It's kind of like pinkish color. Nice big windows. Got the two dogs in the back seat looking out. Don't mind these wheels from Matchbox. And I picked up another one of these to keep on the card, or maybe I'll do a custom with some real riders, who knows. And it's hard to pass up this little trailer. I'm going to paint up the boat and do a bunch of detail to it, and I'll do uh, I'll paint up everything on it, do all the detail on it. It'll look sweet. It's going to be hard to pass these little trailers up when you find it. I wish uh, Hot Wheels would offer some kind of trailer like that. It's pretty cool. So that's my haul today. It's been a while since I've had Hot Wheels on uh, my channel or showed any new Hot Wheels. And I haven't found any in the stores. Haven't found any. So I was really happy that they threw out some A-cases. Put together the two M2 models. They look pretty damn awesome. Them are real flimsy when you stack them. I know they make them so they can be stacked, but uh, I don't know if I would recommend stacking them. Maybe if you held them together with a little uh, glue. I'd probably use a hot glue gun. That way if you ever want to take it off, you could. Pretty nice looking Hot Wheels there though. Really happy with this little haul. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and please leave comments. Thank you.